Hi everybody, it's Miranda, your sexuality coach coming at you today. And ladies, I would like to talk to you about how to strengthen those PC muscles. Now here at Yanni Desires, sexual health is everything to me. And why is that? I believe that your sexual health is wealth. Now, how do I go about strengthening PC muscles, you're asking, right? Well, one way of doing this is through Kegel exercises. And when you Kegel, basically it's just the feeling of when you're going to the washroom and you stop the stream of your pee, that is how you contract those muscles. But times have advanced and there are other ways to strengthen your muscles besides doing that practice. So here are Yanni Desires. I promote Yanni Egg Practice. And this is a yanni egg this is a rose quartz standard size yanni egg this yanni egg right here comes with drilled holes you can get it with or without the holes but i will go over why a lot of women likes to choose this as their first yanni egg we also sell the large rose quartz yanni egg this one is smooth it doesn't have any drill holes. With the large Yanni egg, I recommend it for women who have had children, at least three or more. And the reason why is that is because as you have multiple births, those muscles tend to get a little bit more relaxed and they're not as strong. But don't fret, just like any other muscle, you can build that muscle up. And I will show you how to do that, okay ladies? So back to our standard size. So with our standard size, as I said, it comes with drilled holes. And when you receive your Yanni egg, you will also receive hemp string. This is not hemp string, but I figured I'd show you this so you can get the point. What you wanna do is thread the string through your Yanni egg. like so. Okay. And then make sure you tie it. Okay, you have a nice little knot. Now ladies, what this will do is this will enable you to do Yanni A exercises. And for our women who have the concern of whether your egg will get stuck or not, this is a sure way to make sure that you will be able to pull out your Yanni egg. Now, I do sell Yanni eggs that do not have the holes because there's no way for the egg to go. Inside the vagina, there is the cervix that is at the end of the vagina that goes into the uterus. And because of this, the egg can't go anywhere. So it is impossible for you to lose your egg. But as you strengthen your muscles, you will realize that you will be able to push out your own Yanni egg easily. And then you can move forward and get an egg without the hose. okay? So how do we use this? When you go to insert your Yanni egg, you're going to insert your Yanni egg through the wider end, okay? And if you have any reservations of which end to, to put in first, you will put in the end that does not have the strings. That way, when it's in the vagina, the strings are sticking out, similar to a tampon, okay? So you will set your intention on your egg. So whatever that may be. So if today your intention is to bring love into your heart, strengthen your muscles, this is what you are going to set your mind and in, in your intentions to with your aid. It's almost similar to like a meditative practice. And you want to do this because you want to invite the egg inside of your body. Okay, give yourself permission to accept this egg. You can insert while you're sitting on your bed. You can also insert while you're standing up. 
very similar to a tampon, except you don't have the applicator to push it up, okay? So you will take this egg, gently insert, and you're gonna push up. Now, ladies, this is my pretend vagina, okay? So you're gonna push the egg, and this is the opening. Take your finger, push it on up, and you will feel like a band around the egg. You want to make sure your egg is above it. So you're gonna push, 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 push on up. And ladies, your egg should sit nice and comfortably. It should not feel like it's gonna fall out. It should be well seated. Like so, okay? Now, let's begin our exercises. So while your egg is inside your vagina, what I would like for you to do, ladies, is take a couple of deep cleansing breaths. So we're going to do it. And then we're going to release. Going to take in another cleansing breath. And as you release, I want you to squeeze your muscles and pull down with the string on your release of that breath. Okay. And then relax. Take in another breath. As you blow out, squeeze those muscles and pull down on your string. And what this does is this creates resistance. Your egg should not slip out. You should be able to hold on to your egg. Even if it feels a little loose, this is how your resistance train. And I want you to do this five times. So again, you're gonna inhale. And as you exhale, squeeze the muscles and pull down on your yani A. And you can do this for about a good five to 10 seconds. And as your yani becomes stronger, you can increase the amount of time that you do this. Okay, and when you are ready to remove your yani A, just pull on the string. and your egg will come out. Simple. Ladies, each week I would like you to challenge yourself to increase the amount of time with your Yanni egg practice. Another good exercise that you can do with your Yanni egg is hip thrusters. Now, I'm in the chair, of course, so, but you'll get the idea. So with your yani egg inserted, remember our breathing, right? As you push your hips up, squeeze those quick, squeeze your muscles, and then come back down. Now, of course, you're going to be in a lying position, but this is just so you can get an idea. And then relax as you're sitting. Take in some more deep breaths. Go up with your hips, squeeze your muscles, and then come back down and release. This is another way that you can engage your muscles with your yani egg. Or you can just take your shower, and when you're finished, insert your yani egg. And throughout, I say for about 40 minutes, consciously, Squeeze your muscles, hold your breath, and then release it. Increasing your time as your muscles get stronger. Ladies, this will change your life. You will have great orgasms. You will be able to promote your body to squirt through the G-spot. You will prevent your uterine prolapse, and that is when your uterus starts to fall literally through the vagina. So that is why it's so important to keep those muscles tight. 
This concludes our session for today on Yanni Egg Practice. Please remember to like and subscribe to my page. Um, and if you have any questions, you can always send me a message. Everybody, take care, and we will chat later. Bye.